Hey guys, I'm Shazel Games, and welcome back to Let's Play Gudaman Blind. Um, last time we acquired these cool new goggles. So, the story so far is we've moved to this new town called TSA Town. How the fuck you say that? I have no idea. Please, if you know how to say the name of this town, please tell me in the comments, because I don't know. Um, we moved here because our parents basically kicked us out because they're going on like an excavation abroad and then we're living with our uncle in this mining town. Not our, not our uncle, our grandfather. Anyway, now that we've bought these goggles, let's head out here and see if the story actually progresses. Nothing. Oh, okay. Maybe if we talk to grandpa, something will happen. Maybe. Nope, I've been lied to. It's so boring here. I wish there were kids around. What's that? That was the goofiest dog barking I ever heard. Hey, is that a kid? Help! Help! Oh, she's dead. I just kicked the shit out of a dog. That's fucked up. I knew I wasn't the only kid in town. <laughs> Thank you. She didn't tell me her name. Mm, that's some outfit you've got. What's your name? There we Pino. go. I'm Pino the monster. Monster? Who in the world are you talking to, child? Cute, an imaginary friend. Damn. Wow, a real monster. That's cliche. Um, are you afraid of monsters? Well, unless you have like no, scary I teeth. Was just surprised. Really? I never thought I'd meet a real life monster. Hey, let's be friends. I I a human really wants to be friends with me? I'll take that as a yes. Nice to meet you, Pino. Pino. I was worried about Oh god. Her. Who's the human? She saved me. We're friends. <laughs> friends? Hmm. That a problem? Thank you for helping my sister. Hey, why don't you come to Monster Village nope. with us? Monster Village? Is that really okay, Poo Poo? Don't worry. It'll be fine. Okay, come on! I'll show you the way! There's really a monster village? Okay. It's this way. Of course, through the very... Through that little <sighs> hole? Hmm. This has, I'm gonna get murdered, written all over it. The other side. We live there. It may Along with a bunch strange, of knives. But you'll like it. And guns. This is very suspect, and I wouldn't trust them. No. Wow, an or you're probably gonna die. If you... Come on. No. Parin, no. Come back. God damn it. And here's her dead body. Shit. Huh. Majora's Mask. That 3D, that pre rendered cutscene.
That was a good intro cutscene. It was cute. I'm still surprised we didn't get murdered in that back alley, though. I knew this was gonna be a dance number, I knew it. It's really goofy looking and he's really cute. Them 2004 graphics that have been re-optimized for 2015. It's 2016 now at the time of recording this. He's going at it. Rude. <laughs> nice moves, Poco. Uh, back again? Yeah, it's boring in town. You're strange. Why? Most people are afraid of monsters. You couldn't scare a fly. Hey! Help! Why is everyone tripping this game? Is it because they're Japanese? Help! Please help! What's wrong? Poco. Is that racist? The Phantoms got him! The Phantoms? Oh no! Those monsters from somewhere else? Yeah, and they're really dangerous. Ha! My pretty tornado kick will teach them a thing or two. That's some kick. But these phantoms mean business. Wait, what if she could use... What if I could use what? Why'd you just fucking stop talking right there? What does this guy got to say? And your name is Poco or something? With that, you can fight the phantoms. I didn't get anything, but they're still tough. When I grow up, I'll fight all those mini phantoms by myself. The guy's name is Chucky. He's really cute. He's like a little dinosaur. What's your name? Pierre. Bonjour, mi pretty mademoiselle. How could Poco get kidnapped by phantoms? He's always so careful. I hope he's alright. Alright? This guy? His name is Rocco. Apt. Pugu and Pino came here after losing their family. They're always in inseparable. Why, why'd you... Why? Why'd you say it like that? Alright, Pino, what do you have for us? There's a special weapon hidden here! That's convenient. A weapon? Here? Go on! Touch it! <laughs> this is very suggestive. Chucky creepily in the background. Nobody's been able to pull it out. Give it a nope. try. I pull it out and it's like, it's like fucking that creepy guy's dick cylinder. It's like this is all just one big euphemism. Will you buy me a strawberry shortcake if I pull it out? Just do it. Nope, she can't pull it out. Game's over. Was it? I don't believe it. Now we can fight the phantoms. Pino, do you know where the phantoms are? I think they're in the ruins. Please go and see. Damn, my Poco's brother. fucking going at it. I'm on the case. I'll stay here and support you with my dance. Is that how that works? I feel better already. Well, she killed him. She straight up killed that guy. I'm a murderer. I'm a murderous child. Hmm. Alright, they let me attack. Um, I'm going to save. Everyone says it's dangerous outside. But lots of cookies and chocolates in town, just in case. That drill is so cool. Cool? It's a legendary effort. Blah. It's a legendary weapon. It must be cool. I guess. Phantoms took my brother to the ruins. Please save him. I guess. Begrudgingly. I hear the Phantom Prince has four servants. Please take care, mademoiselle. What about you, Rocco? The Phantoms first appeared in this world three years ago. We aren't sure where they came from or what they want. 
I hear these... I hear there's bases in the northern mountains. Please be careful. Boing, 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 boing. All right, let's go. Let's fucking do this. Let's save. Oh, what the fuck was his name? Generic character. No ancient ruins here. Wow. This. How was he here? We left town, and he was standing there dancing. Come to see me dance? Nope. Fine. I guess I have to go this way. What about here? No. All right. Right, these are the ruins, but... The ruins are on your right. Don't fucking... Don't tell me how to live my life. These must be the ruins Pino was talking about. Hmm? Oh, well. So you're the phantom that kidnapped Puku. I am afraid you are. He's mistaken. really cute. I am merely an innocent monster passing by. The phantoms went deep inside the ruins. Call me stupid, but I'm going to believe you. Nice drill you have there. Take good care of it. I'm off. Bye, weirdo. No, for real, that guy was really weird. So is this like, yeah, this is like my dodge roll, I guess. This is my actual attack. B is jump, and Y opens the same menu. All right, let's look this way. No, this, no, no, all right. Hmm. What's this? No, what's this? No. Oh, I can jump and attack. The music in this game is really cool. It's very catchy. Ooh, that was weird. Potato Ruins. The Nanometer Shrine, I think it said. Can't hit that pillar, alright. Well, I can, but it won't break. This jar? Eh, I got a critical on the jar. You drop money. Crime does pay. There's nothing back this way, so let's move on. What's the sign say? Something is written here. Nice. Good job, Pardon. Very observant. Explore. Use coaster and right click to move. Just jump, hit extra space bar. Destroy. You can destroy all kinds of things with Z or left click. If you find something that you can't destroy, try charge attack. Hold down Z or left button and charge up your drill, and then let go of the key to release the charge attack. The more you charge, the more powerful your attack will be. Alright. I, I figured that out for myself. Alright, fuck these jars. This is like perfect for me. I love breaking shit to get money. I was gonna say, can I get up here? I'll go back for that. Eh. Once again, I got a critical on the jar. Very helpful. I'm sure that jar poses a real threat to me. Eh. I feel like I'd be interested in seeing a speedrun of this game. Did I just run on the wall? That's fucking bomb. Wow. This game is really cool. We haven't even gotten to, like, actual combat yet. Alright, let's try this charge attack thing. Oh, there's money. You're gonna block the gate when there's money there? Hit Z or left attack with your drill. For a critical hit, time your attacks in the moment of the star and the note converge on the timing bar. Press X and Z simultaneously to toss enemies into the air. This is a quick, quick explanation of all this stuff on the screen. Um, da, 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 I can think. It's pretty self-explanatory. Money. No. I hope that's still there when I beat this guy. More guys. I like the music criticals. It reminds me of Mother 3 a bit. Well, we can't really break the wall when there are spiders kissing the shit out of us right now, Parin. Yeah. 
jar. Oh, it's a good thing these spiders are barely dangerous. Alright, that guy is murdered. Oh, my money is gone. Why would they do that? That's horrible. I hate that. Let's go through this. It's... Is the same thing gonna happen right now? Alright, no, I get to keep the money. I'm fine with that. Are these little boxes? Oh my god! They spit fire? Why do they spit fire? They're like demon boxes. I guess you could say they are phantom boxes. What's in here? I got a cookie! I don't trust chest cookies. But I guess I have to. What's in here? Cannons. Just to say. Something he's written here. Guard dash. Guard dash is for avoiding attacks. Alright, so it's literally the thing. It's the dodge thing that I was doing before. I'm not in control of this right now. I'm just doing it on its own. I think it'd be nice enough to turn the thing off for me, but I guess not. Um, okay, that's the way to progress, and we can't go back the way we came. So let's move on. I really like this game so far. I was, like, a little bit apprehensive of doing a blind Let's Play, but I kind of don't regret it. Aww, the thing is so cute. That's a phantom, huh? I completely skipped over this sign, so let's see what it says. Something is written here. Drill level up. Your drill level will drop when you take damage. Successful critical hits will gradually increase your drill power. Drilling magic earth will immediately increase your drill level by one. 100 critical hits will also increase your drill level. Alright. Huh. That's cool. I'm gonna save. Jar. Jar. No jar is back this way, so this thing is a phantom over here, so we're gonna murder it. What's up? That guy was sturdy. But he's dead now. Money! How much do those give me? I didn't actually look. Right, the gold ones give me 5 per drop. I think the, the, the bronze ones give me 10. And the silver ones give me 1. Oh, I didn't know you could break these. Cool. Yeah, the bronze ones are worth 10. Alright. Let's do this wall. Oh, there's alarms here, apparently. Oh, the phantom has a little hat. A mohawk, rather. Oh, God. He's dead. It's not hard so far. And then again, this is the first dungeon, so it's expected to be not hard. I forgot what button was Z. Man. I'll figure it out. Use a heal point to heal the damage you've taken. I haven't taken any damage, so I'm not going to use it. Ow, and now I took damage. I murdered that crate. What's this gotta say? Something is written here. There are three kinds of boxes. Um, wooden crates, I can move and break. Reinforced, I can move but not break. And iron, I can't do either. Stand in front of a box to grab it. And use the cursor with the mouse to move the box. Alright.
Was I lied to? I feel like I was lied to. Stand in front of a box to grab it. And use the cursor with the mouse to move the box. Alright. There we go. I had to keep standing in front of the box. Alright, that should be far enough. Jump. Good. Maybe I should go back and heal. I feel like something significant is going to be through that door, so I'm going to call it a part here. After we heal up. Did I just get naked? That was weird. That was highly inappropriate, and I'm really uncomfortable with that. Anyway, I'm going to call it a part here. Uh, I've been Shazel Games, and thank you very much for watching my blind playthrough of Guruman, A Monstrous Adventure. I will see you in the next part, and don't forget to like and subscribe and all that good shish. Bye, guys.